Edition LLC. Um, today we're going to be doing some uh, projector mapping <laughs> applications. Sorry if you hear a little coughing going on in the background. I'm still fighting a cold. Um, we're going to be showing off our professional uh, Black Cinema One. This is one of the best screen paints we've ever developed. As a matter of fact, I have it throughout the entire apartment. I have it at 159 inch 1610 and the first room and in here we have both walls coated with that technology. The ceiling is using a projector mapping uh, technology. So this technology has a little bit of everything in it. It's fantastic for gaming, it's fantastic for movies and sports and TV shows, and it also too has uh, a bit of a projector mapping capabilities, which we're gonna be displaying right now. I just finished working on the platform for the showcase. If you see showcases popping up, <coughs> sorry about that. A showcase is basically a page uh, that we designed to add more information, more videos, uh, about the product because the pages do have uh, that are available on the site just aren't big enough to supply what we need to add in all right so we got some copyright free music playing in the background and i am going to start uh do two applications for projector mapping today and then we'll do some gaming because this stuff has amazing gaming capabilities uh we're pushing to um get our products um offline we have them online like i said but mainly we're pushing to get them offline to get more publicity toward the products and the only products we are going to be displaying offline are just going to be the black technology it pretty much people are fascinated by it so yeah, i think that's the direction we need to go black technology is where it's at it's the future and um we proved it time and time again why black technology is so much more advanced than the gunmetal gray screens and white screens. These are old traditional screens compared to this technology. It has so many applications to it that other screens cannot complete, seem to do. So we're going to be uh, displaying that in the showroom uh, for outdoor applications, uh, uh, movie applications, and TV shows, and just everyday all around things that you can do with the technology, which is absolutely amazing. It does produce a 100% contrast level regardless of the projector capabilities due to the fact that the technology is black and produces an extremely high white level because it's using something called Heitner technology which we're blessed to be able to have. Now in order for the scanner to be able to pick up it has to be able to read white light and if the image would come up too dark then the scanner wouldn't be to pick it up it wouldn't be to display any colorful images to the surface the surface has already been scanned already so all i have to do is just go into the computer and just basically just put in whatever i want or draw whatever I want on the wall and it'll come up on the wall uh, the technology is fully ambient light projection which means you can use it in a fully lit environment you don't have to worry about your screen washing out or fading or the colors washing out or any of that nonsense because the technology is designed to absorb light, which you wish never have a problem. But we'll go along and we'll show you exactly how amazing this product is. Um, I'm going to be adding these videos to the site so that way we can have videos to add to the showcase. All right, so let me begin. Or should I begin? Oops, I'm going to stand there.
So we put our first application on. We got our giant dragon. So that's the first layer. Um, next one, we'll do some rose petals. Treadmills? Nah, they're all the same. You know, our treadmill's can adjust speed and incline automatically, so you never break your stride. Try the Peloton Tread risk free with a 30 day home trial. New members only. Not available in remote locations. See additional terms at onepeloton.com slash home dash trial.
Apologize for the coughing. As I said before, I have a cold. So we're going through it. off here for a minute so you can see kind of what we got a chance to do up here so we can add banners moving dragons rose petals I mean, um cherry blossoms just about anything you can possibly think of and it's candy light rejection technology and of course we would get a commercial right in the middle of the video uh, let me see, just back to our music. There we go. All right, so that's the software right there. These are the multiple, hold on for a minute. I gotta go in here, design first. There we go. Here's the design we just did. There's the multi-layer applications right here. So for each one of these, it's a different application. This is a different application, but the rose petals are different applications, multi-layers. So you can actually stack layers on top of each other to make art work become more realistic. So what we want to do is, instead of having, um, instead of having multiple screen paints, and I've been to this before, we've had this discussion before about having all these different screen paints, it becomes a freaking headache. It comes a headache, it's just too much. So we wanna narrow it down to one product that does it all. And this is where we're working with this particular product because this used to be a 44, and 44 had projector mapping capabilities where we had the overhead and all that other stuff. <coughs> so, we want a screen paint that does everything. It does gaming, it does movies, it does sports, it does a whole nine yards. It's a little bit of projector mapping application. It can also can be used for outside because it's fully weatherproof. We want an all-in-one product. This cuts down on a whole lot of work and a whole lot of advertising. Just brings it down to one single product and that's it. And that's what we're working with the professional one. This is why anytime you see a paint coated through the entire place where I'm at, if it's the only one you see, it is the main one we're working on and it's the one that's considered to be the best. Now, in order for this technology to be to be scanned, because like I said, people may talk, but they don't know anything about projector mapping. I do, because I work with this stuff. 
In order for that scanner to be to scan that wall and pick up an image, it has to read white light. If the image comes up too dark, it can't pick it up. It's going to come up dirty and it's going to come up cloudy. That's the problem. So what we're using right now for our projector mapping, because we get asked this all the time, what kind of equipment we're using. This is called Lifeform. Unfortunately, the company, sorry about the shirt on the floor. Unfortunately, the company is uh, no longer in business anymore. Um, fantastic company. I wish they would have stayed around, but they didn't. You know, something, I guess things didn't go well. But they were the ones that came up with a really easy idea for anyone. If you didn't know much about projector mapping, you could easily learn it in no time at all. Tell you the basics of it all. So they did a fantastic job with it. And other than that, it was extremely affordable because the stuff is really expensive. All right, so we got a nice drag in there. Let's um, go in and change the scenery. in a cold so you'll be hearing some coughing in the background all right got to turn this to the side over here and the reason why we have to do it this way because one of the things i didn't like about the um the program is the fact that it does flash some personal information up which i don't even know how that would even work if you're outside doing demonstrations because all your information would just boof pop up and i have to do a rescan here I'm gonna have to because there's no way in the world I'm gonna be able to pass through that area without basically hitting the scanner at the same time that's definitely gonna become a problem let me see what this scanner is gonna be seeing see this is what I'm seeing on my end see there's me right there and that's what the scanner is picking up The only thing I don't like about it, why did they make it that way so sensitive information process. Make your first move with battery power made by steel. Let me see. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to come up with a scan. That should be good. As long as, I don't, as long as the projector does not hit the stand, if the projector doesn't hit the stand, then we're good. See those white levels popping up? Yeah. That means that technology can read white light. That scanner has to be to read those white levels pretty high. If you can't read it, well, it's not going to work. And the 44 that was converted to the 48 pulls the highest white level out of any technology we have so far until the Alpha 1's launch. It'll be the highest next. Cool. We didn't 
too bad. Uh, here's one of those simple. bright that color pops up yeah that's why we had to put a heightener level 3 in it because it's much more darker than any other products we made and that heightener 3 allows the screen to be able to produce a really high white level which is needed to pull color especially with projector mapping applications and the most important thing with projector mapping application is a 100% contrast level because if I'm going to produce the galaxies or stars or wherever I want anywhere I need to be at that surface is going to have to pull 100% contrast level in order for that to activate.
fantastic for companies and businesses that want to do projector mapping. They want to do a little artistic display on their walls for restaurants, businesses, and wherever else they want to put it at. It's also fantastic for basically for schools, for basically for kindergarten classes and stuff like that. It adds something new to the wall. So instead of looking at the same boring wall over and over again, you can convert it into a projector mapping application surface. See our design we have here. Got our shamrocks of four leaf clover just running down the side of the screen. Nice splash display. Got the word luck in the same writing. And I got some gold coins splashing in the background. Simple, easy. Now, our product here on the professional one has been tested. If you want to check out test demonstrations, we do have all test demonstrations displayed directly to the website for our customers. You can see exactly the transition the product had to go through before it was ever sold to the customers. I like this one. I'm saving this one for my file. Usually I don't save these, but I'm going to save this one. see what we got here for time yeah we're good no no we're actually out of time all right we only do two of these i got two more of these to do to fill up this show page so we'll be doing another one i got two other ideas i want to display also too all right with that being said gotta go thank you for your time and god bless and this is our professional black cinema one screen paint just showing you some of the applications you can do with the products besides watching movies sports or anything else you want to do with it all right gotta go thank you all and god bless